The expectations that Johnson City Schools has for its students uh, seems to me something of the sky's the limit. The teachers are gonna make sure that that child has what they need to feel challenged. Student learning in my classroom, the bar is set high, and I provide them the scaffolding to reach that bar. They give us challenge work sometimes. They'll give us challenge work or extra credit. Well, that pushes us to like do better. Every decision in Johnson City is based on what's most important for that individual student. If you don't look at the whole student, you might miss something. We know they're going to come to us with multiple needs, and you know we take responsibility for that. Differentiated instruction is key to being able to reach those individual students. So within a given lesson, a teacher might have five to six different transitions of, of different styles of teaching to reach that student. The HEROES program is the mental health component to our educational system. We have the typical school counselors, but in addition we have a therapeutic counselor and we have a caseworker. HEROES is one of those support mechanisms that we use as a team to, when we find a student who is struggling, oftentimes it's more than just the learning environment in the classroom. It has way more to do with other things going on in that student's life. We feel like meeting the emotional needs of that student are extremely important to be able to go on with the learning needs of the student. The HEROES program has really been beneficial in making sure students are ready to learn once they arrive at school. I want to reach out to those struggling students and let them know we love you and care about you and we want you to be successful. The combination of all of these different, very talented, very dedicated parties that come together, the students are in a position to succeed and perhaps exceed what the parents have hoped for their kids.